number 69. This is uh, Gene Loves Jezebel. I can't get enough of this story. Uh, the song Desire, Come and Get It, which was also number six in 1986. It's still a hit. They're still playing yeah. it, and it's still in the charts. Um, and, and now Gene Loves Jezebel lives on in different uh, formations. So uh, It appears okay, there's so two different versions. versions. <laughs> You yeah, Michael's yes, exactly. Gene Loves Jezebel, and you have yeah. Jay's Gene Loves Jezebel. Um, uh, this song, first of all, yeah, I agree. Like, one of the most important tracks to come out in the 80s. Uh, I was a huge fan. I stalked this band for a little while. Um, <laughs> stole makeup tips. I, I loved them because <laughs> they were doing that thing that the cult was in a weird way. It's like gothy metal. Um, and you know, they sort of evolved and became more pop, but in those early days before they even had radio singles, I was into this band. Um, mm. in fact, I still have the vinyl, the autographed vinyl from them. Um, I, yeah, I, I would be the guy waiting outside backstage or I'd somehow get, uh, an interview with them. And, uh, so I was a huge fan. I was really bummed. I was friends with uh, Jay on Facebook for a while. Then he killed his account. I was really bummed to hear the brothers weren't getting along for so long because I really felt that the magic between those two, especially on stage, was phenomenal. Um, having seen them numerous times, I thought it was great. I've never seen uh, the band without the brothers playing together. So would oh, you very nice <laughs> yeah I still love it man i still love that song did you okay did you play this mountain goat song were you familiar with no, this song I'm not familiar with that song at all oh did you play it did you listen to I it i did not i'm sorry I oh. Go through it. You, oh you have man, to it's should... really fucking funny <laughs> okay wait which which it's not the it's not the um the cover or the spoof song, is it? It's the abandoned flesh. It's the um it, it kind of tells their story. It it you know, it's kind of based on the Wikipedia page of uh, like, you know, that they're not getting along oh my anymore. God, okay, uh, I have to go back and listen to this yeah. song. Like, what a weird song to address somebody else's <laughs> like what a novel idea. <laughs> oh my god. It touches on everything. It's just uh yeah, I I, I'm, I'm glad you yeah. listened to it, Holly. I, yeah. Thank oh. you for doing your homework, Holly. I, I knew I knew I'd be challenged if I wasn't up to, you know, I mean, Mark, I know your background, so I need to know my, my stuff. <laughs> but they are. They, I'll go listen to the Mountain Goats song, though. Are, did, you play, did you play Mountain Goats music on, on like, PNW or, no. like, or EXP? No, we did you play? Uh, no? KXP, oh. yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Yeah, because. Yeah, he, yeah, it's a perfect AAA yeah. band. I, I love what they put out. It's yeah. amazing. Uh, okay, uh, and I'll probably put that in the uh, 